From the outback to the sea, dusty roads are for me. Come along and be part of my family. On this video, I'm just going to show you a part of South Australia that, uh, well, I never thought would, would come here, and that's the Second World War. Well, actually, it's a war that never was. But South Australia was almost a part of. And this is the uh, old radar station here at Port Gibbon in South Australia, which was built for about two weeks before the end of World War II. I'll tell you a little bit more in a minute. Department of Defence. Igloos constructed during the Second World War to be used as air raid shelters, large barracks and two for radio and two for radio location towers, each 132 feet high. Construction of the site was almost finished when peace was declared. So the towers and sheds were sold in 1946, the towers being sold for £10 each. How's that? You'll find these igloos in a weak paddock about 18 kilometres from Cal on the Air Peninsula and they are some really remarkable structures from years gone by. The igloo like landmarks are well known by the locals here uh, today but the, their initial purpose dates back to a time when it seemed Australia faced an imminent invasion by the Japanese. The story of the cement structures is shrouded in secrecy even today. Amazing I thought. Despite all the secrecy and effort, the radar station 203 was never used. The defeat of the Japanese at the Battle of Midway led to the scrapping of this radar project and over time, farmers dismantled the radar towers using the wood for shearing sheds and the like. The concrete structures got a guernsey as well, hosting dancers, picnics and the locals. So the word got out. We're going to go into the right up here, I suppose, and go up to the beach or something, or wherever you want to go. I don't care. Here or here will do. Just 
Capri on the other side of the beach area. Little caravan park, dump point, toilets, and enough room here for probably three or four vans. This one's site six here, and the kids' playground. Gibbon Beach Camping. Looks like there's someone in there now. Yeah. 